hello everyone in this video we are going to discuss about the some of the laboratory experiments of the digital fluency so the digital fluency is a mandatory subject for the first and third uh, first and second semester of undergraduate courses so there are some of the laboratory activities the first activity is the identifying the configuration and version of computer system or laptop and mobile phone now let me start i have already prepared a manual so laboratory activities for the digital fluency so the first step which i already mentioned here to click on the start menu then go to settings and once it opens click the system and go go to the about section so there this briefing will be there now this is the windows 8 which i am using now what i do Uh, first of all i have already opened the control panel so i will close this i will minimize this now if i want to know the configuration of my laptop so what i do i will click on the search first of all i will open the control panel control panel right so there will be a control panel app click on this app so you will be getting this uh, window in this window you can see there is a system and security if you click on system and security again you will be getting so many options in this there will be a system right so there will be a system so if you see the system in this system if you click on the system so you will be getting the details regarding the system which i am using right so my laptop configuration is windows 8 is my operating system samsung is the my laptop so i am using samsung laptop right so therefore you can see in the system there is a manufacturer samsung electronics rating 4.4 and the processor is the intel core i3 processor so 2328m and the cpu 2.2 gigahertz speed cpu i am using and uh, installed ram ram available in my laptop is 2 gb of ram and total usable ram is 1.71 gb is usable by me and system type is 64 bit operating system i am using so windows 8 is a 64 bit operating system and uh, i don't have any pen or touch input available right now for my laptop so therefore you can see no pen or touch input is available for this display so this is or all the details or you can say that the configuration of my laptop which i am using right so after this if you see in the experiment there is a computer system the same thing you, you can click on the start button which is available at the bottom of this uh, task bar you will be getting a startup menu in the startup menu there will be a run option or you will be getting a run dialog box a uh, text box so simply type control panel you will be getting the same control panel and you can click on the system configuration so that you can find the system configuration so i will continue uh, this video with the mobile phone and you can find how you can check the configuration of your mobile phone now here we will understand how we can check the configuration of the mobile so right now i am having a samsung device samsung galaxy m30 i want to know the details of this uh, device so what i do in my apps i will go to the settings app i will open the settings 
and you can see in the setting itself you can find the name right so first of all go to settings and just uh, scroll down to the bottom of the list and check about the phone now if you see there are n number of options are available i want to know the details of my device so about phone so if i click on about phone i will be getting all the details regarding my device like it's a galaxy m30s phone number unknown i have not mentioned it so model name is there model number is there serial number is there and uh, a slot one slot two numbers are there status information is there so if i click on the status information my sim card status meme uh, M E E I information i can get it so if i click on this uh, sim card status so i will be getting all the details regarding the sim card and even though if i am accessing internet there will be a ip address so this ip address is of my phone 192.168.1.3 and uh, wi-fi mac address is there serial number all the details related to my phone will be there okay so there is a battery information so level and battery capacity is 6000 mah software information so one ui core version 3.1 android version is 11 and uh, google play system updated on 1st july 2022 base band version m30 and a kernel version that is a kernel file name built number is there when it was built and se for android status software engineering status software provide information version security software versions android security patch level that is 1st october 2020 so this is all about my cell phone so this is how you can check the configurations of your computer system laptops and your uh, mobile phones there will be a looking for something else is there software updates you want to update the software you can click on the software update so you will be getting uh, these three options so whether you want to update it so you can update or uh, you can update it later so reset 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 means you can go for the previous settings and for contact us so you will be uh, getting the information of, of the manufacturer so you can contact see go to samsung member so this is all about the details of the smartphone so kindly keep watch my videos and uh, i will be coming with the second experiment of the digital fluency in the next video thank you for watching